guys, so this is the look I came up with for you guys today. It's kind of like a really dramatic smoky eye. So if you guys are interested in learning how to get this look, then keep watching. Bye. Okay, so jumping on in there, I got one eye done already, but I still have a freaking ah, big guy up here, but I'm gonna show you how I did it. So first I'm starting out with um, NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in Milk, and I'm going to be applying that to my inner corner. Just like so. Because I wanna highlight the inner corner. Anytime you're doing a smoky eye, you need to highlight your inner corner, otherwise it's gonna look crazy. Let's tap that in. Then I'm going to use the same kind of pencil but in black, so a jumbo pencil in black, and I'm going to prime my eye using that eye pencil a little bit underneath, just a little bit because these are really pigmented. So then I'm just going to blend that into the milk very carefully like that and up my eyelid and that's what's going to be my base hard to see. I'm going to use a mirror. So I'm going to blend that all over my eyelid. Make a mess on my fingers. And that's what's going to make my eyeshadow stick. And the reason why I'm not using a normal eye primer for this is because I want it really dark and smoky. And if you use a darker base, then you're going to get a darker um, overall finish. And I'm just going to smudge that under my eye a little bit too. Just like that. I know it looks messy, but the end product will look nice. Um, then, I don't want to get a mess down here, so I'm going to do that sticky tape trick. I don't have the rest of my face done, I'll do that later, but I just want to make sure I'm not going to get anything down here. So I'll just put that on there. Okay, so what I'm going to do next is my base is on. So I'm going to use this really dense eyeshadow brush. It's by, I think by Quo, and it's an eye contour brush. But the colors that I'm going to be using is out of the Naked One, the first palette. And the color that I'm going to be using is this color Gunmetal. It's like a blue-gray. Since I'm wearing blues and grays, I wanted to use it. So I'm going to get some of that on my brush, quite a bit of it. I'm going to pack it on there. Like just start packing it on. You want to put a lot because then we're going to blend it upwards. So just pack it on. Up to your brow bone like that. Then I'm going to grab this really, really fluffy brush by Quo as well. It's called Crease Shadow Brush, but it's really fluffy. And I'm just going to start blending that in. And I'm going to look at my other mirror because it's easier. So I'm just going to start blending that very, very lightly. Blending that in. Windshield wiper motions, people. Blend, blend, blend away. Takes a while. That's why I did one eye before. So I'm going to add a bit more of that gunmetal. here just to match the other side. I'm going to get a little bit more on my brush just like that and blend that. Then I'm going to start adding other colors because you want to transition. You don't want it to just end like that. So I'm going to take another brush. This is um, an eyeshadow brush by Lancome, and I'm going to jump into this color called Buck, this brown color, and I'm just going to add a little bit, and I'm going to work that right into where I want my gunmetal to end, right into there. I'll work that in as a transition color. Then I'm going to go back in again with the gunmetal and redefine my eye. Hang on a second, I'm just going to um, turn on my light. Hopefully that's better. I don't know if that's better. Is it better? 
a little bit. So, um, where was I? Oh yes, I lost my brush though. So I'm gonna add a little bit more of the gunmetal just to my brow bone over top of where I put that transition color. Just gonna tap it in a little bit. I'm gonna bring the gunmetal underneath my eye as well. Just like that. Then I'm going to take the same blending brush and blend away. Blend, blend, blend. I'm gonna check myself out in this other mirror. Okay, so that's about it for the gunmetal. I'm going to start to add my highlights in. So I'm going to take um, mum, 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 mum. this uh, 239 brush by MAC. And using the same palette, I'm going to go for this really light highlight, Virgin. So I'm going to take some of that and I'm going to add it to my brow bone. Just like that. I'm going to take a little bit of Sin to add that in. Sin is the color right beside Virgin. I think I did that last time. I don't know. It's been a while. I can't remember. And I'm going to blend those in. Blend it in. Just like that. Let's check myself out here. Flip the mirror around. Okay, we're getting there. I just want to add a little bit more of the buck, the brown. Just to get a better transition. Just like that. Okay, I'm going to remove my sticky tape. Because I don't need that anymore. Ooh. And it's a really sharp line, but I want to blend it just a tad bit. So I'm going to take a fluffy brush and just kind of blend it a little. Just like that. Under my eye. So where I put the milk, I have this um, LA Colors kind of glitter highlighter. I'm just going to take a little bit of that color. A brush comes with it, but it's like, look at that. Actually, I'll just use a brush, whatever. I'm gonna add some of that glitter into my inner corner on top of the milk, just like that. I don't know what the color of this is. It's, the, it's like the whitest one. Um, Snow White! That's what color it is, Snow White. So, my next step is I'm going to um, do my waterline, and I'm using Perversion 24-hour eyeliner. So that's that. Then I'm going to go ahead and do winged eyeliner. And for my winged eyeliner, I'm going to be using Black Track by MAC. And I'm going to be using a... I'm not sure what this is anymore, the, the number. It's the smallest angle brush that they have. Um, I'm going to use that to start. So I'm just going to get into the MAC Black Track. And you want to follow this line where your eyelashes end. I'm just going to use my other mirror. And you're going to make a line like so. Then you're going to connect it. You're going to bring it across into your lash line. All the way across. Like that. Now I like my winged eyeliner a little bit darker than that. So I'm going to go ahead and add um, some L'Oreal Linear Intense um, Liquid Eyeliner on top of that. Per um, not Perversion, MAC Gel Liner. Just because it gives it a darker, more patent look. And I'm going to do 
the same thing down on the inner rim. So that's the eyeliner. So now I'm going to go ahead and add my mascara. Still using the They're Real by Benefit. I love this mascara. I cannot thank you enough, Courtney, for giving me that sample because it changed my life. Oh, it changed my life. Oh, my God. Anywho, I'm going to slap some of that shit down on my bottom eyelid. Not eyelid. Eyelashes. Frig, I'm so bright. I'm the brightest crayon they got in that Crayola box. Slap some of that down there. Then, I'm going to curl my eyelashes. Curl my eyelashes. Curl my eyelashes. Curl, curl, curl my eyelashes. I really need some friends. Um, and then I'm going to use my favorite Dior Show Maximizer. I'm going to put a, quite a few coats of this on because I want a really dramatic, um, this is a primer by the way, dramatic eyelash because of the dark eyeshadow. And I don't wear fake eyelashes. You could put a fake eyelash on if you wanted to. And it would look much better, but I find fake eyelashes ruin your natural eyelashes. They like pull them out. So, get them all in there so that has to set so while that's setting I'm gonna go ahead and do my eyebrow on the side because it's really bothering me <sighs> <Weirdo. sighs> ah! dropping things okay so gonna hop on in I'm gonna use sorry the Revlon color stay gel eyeliner this is really good I find it's getting really dry so I'm probably, I'm, next time I go to MAC, I'm probably going to get their brown eyeliner and see how that works because it's getting really dry. So, again, I'm going to try to line it up here. Right there, maybe? I don't know, I'll use this bottom mirror. If you guys haven't seen my eyebrow tutorial, go watch it. I might do a new eyebrow tutorial because the last one was really hard to see. I did it in my bathroom and the quality is really, really poor. So, if you guys want me to do a better, more in-depth, maybe even how I groom my eyebrows and shape them. If you guys want to see that, then comment below and I'll show you guys how I do that. Um, so I'm just going to do my eyebrows. I'm not going to explain as I go because I already have an eyebrow tutorial. Or if you want to know, then I can make a new one. However you want to do it, ladies and gentlemen. It's your call. Your wish is my command! Or however you say it. There. Much better. Ooh, yeah! Eyebrow! Hi! This is why I'm always late for work! Where the fuck is. Oh, there it is. Okay. It's gonna blend it a little. Okay, this should be set now. So I'm going to curl it one more time. Curl, 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 curl. That's good, whatever. So I'm going to put like a lot of coats. I'm actually going to add some more to the other side too. Okay, so again, start at the base. And wiggle in. And don't do anywhere else other than the base at first because you want to build all of your mascara at the base first to make a nice full eyelash. I know I'm supposed to be looking at you but I look over here to see what I'm doing. Damn it! When will I ever learn? I don't know. So I'm still building at the base because I want them nice and full and so now I'm going to start bringing the mascara up. I'm going to start bringing it up. That's about it. I'm going to go ahead and do the rest of my face and do my hair because I look a bun. 
And then I'll show you the final look, but I'll just show you the eyes really quickly in the light. Can you see that? Smoking. So I'm going to do the rest of that, and then I will show you the final look. I finished my hair. I did a long braid in the back. I'll show you. Can you see it? The lighting is really bad, and I did my, my bumped ponytail. I don't know if you can see that. But I'm ready to go to work today, so... I hope you enjoyed this. And now do I my animals are Walnut! Walnut! Come here! Come here! Let's go find her. Let's go find her and harass her. Yeah. I feel like, oh, there she is. She's a man. Let's go say hi. There she is. There's my girl. That's my girl. Mwah! Hi, say hi, buddy.